Hello guys, welcome back to Mini's Tea. So you guys, popular podcaster Mac G is pissed and he's ready to take down each and every celebrity who joined the forces in dragging his put his podcast called Podcast and Chill with Mac G. This comes after they got dragged on the uh for their homophobic slurs on their previous episodes, which saw one of their biggest sponsors of Mutual uh basically uh pulling out from sponsoring from sponsor Sponsoring his podcast. So the outrage from that episode when McG was heard saying homophobic slurs did not only come from the LGBTQI community, you guys, it came from a number of celebrities who then decided that McG should be cancelled. So during their latest episode, McG, the ghost lady, and So Penduga sat down to discuss that episode which uh, offended the LGBTQI community. And McG, he was basically dragging each and every celebrity who came for him. So McG uh, called these celebrities fake and uh, accused them of being two-faced. He pointed out that most of these celebrities jump to certain to certain issues because they want to trend. Uh, but when it comes to issues like gender-based violence and rape, they are nowhere to be seen. But to further prove his point, Mac G actually referred to the issue of DJ Fresh and how accusations of rape keep haunting him. He further stated that many of these celebrities chose to remain silent and, and not say anything when he trended for rape again. Mac G says that it is because DJ Fresh uh, controls their bags and his influence in the media industry is so big that they do not want to fumble with their bags. And on that statement, you guys, I completely uh, see where McG is coming from. Like when DJ Fresh and Euphonic started trending, when this lady accused them of dragging her and raping her, allegedly, you guys. And most celebrities did not say anything at all. I think the only celebrity who actually came out on Twitter and uh, supported the victim was uh, only Ntigi Mazwai. And... I think that it was the only person who publicly, like on a public platform, came out in support of the victim. Like most celebrities did not say anything at all. Like none of them actually talked about these rape accusations. So it is rather interesting to see uh, that these celebrities, when it comes to other big celebrities, they do not speak out when uh, one of their fellow celebrities uh, do something wrong. So this is my opinion, you guys. So don't come for me. This is just what I think, okay? So so what I think is that these celebrity uh, beef or celebrity fights that Meg G is having with these celebrities are taking away the sincerity of the real issue. The real issue, you guys, is that our society is not educated when it comes to the LGBTQI community. Like, uh... I feel like Matt G should have apologized from his podcast, not through a media statement. Like his podcast has a lot of viewership, like a lot of people will listen to his podcast. And I felt like that media statement, not a lot of people saw that uh, he apologized through that media statement. So I feel like if uh, Matt G is going to do a mistake on his podcast and when he wants to clarify that mistake and apologize from that mistake, he should also do it on his podcast because that statement i'm pretty sure you guys it only reached a small number of people where else on his podcast he could reach a large number of people and till this day some people think that mcg hasn't apologized for his homophobic slurs but if he had addressed this uh this whole uh drama through his podcast most people could have heard him apologize for what he said so anyways, you guys, that is all the tea that I have for you at this moment. And as always, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video if you care. And I will see you guys on my next video.